through the consent form. As I said, Dr. Armadiris will be going through your consent form again prior to the surgery. Mm -hmm. So save up all your questions to ask him then as well, okay? okay? Even if you write them all down on a piece of paper and bring it with you on the day of the surgery, he'll go through everything with you again. Mm -hmm. um, if you'd like to, you can always email me directly. My email details are all in the folder here as well. So you can always email me your questions and we can go through that too. Great. Okay. Um, now your estimate of fees. Um, Dr. Almadiris just goes by the standard AMA rate. He doesn't generally charge above that. Mm -hmm. um, so everything is stipulated here. Um, the anaesthetist as well. Um, there will be a gap uh, in relation to the anaesthetist fees um, between uh, what Medicare and the private health funds pay back and what the charges are. Same with Dr. Almadiris. There will also be a small gap in relation to his fees. Okay. Mm -hmm. We do have international mm -hmm. fellows that work with us as well from overseas, just letting you know who might be there on the day for the theatre. might be a few different people, okay? But Dr. Almadiris is the one who does your surgery. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, <coughs> we do sometimes film our surgeries, Let's just letting you know that in signing this, it gives us consent to use that for educational purposes. And there are risks and complications associated with any surgery. Um, the more um, they are rare, they are listed here. Mm. It's a good idea to take, I will give you a copy of this to take home. Have a look through it. Um, and if, you are, if there are any further questions, please just give me a call and I can answer the, um, any queries over the phone or email okay. me and I'll answer that. Okay? Great. Cool. Okay, if I could just get you to sign. Sure that the out of pocket expenses. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you. Any questions mm. you'd like to ask me? No, I just was booked in for Wednesday. Um, you'll be getting in touch with me regarding um, pre-administration mm -hmm. procedures, mm -hmm. etc. Yeah. Yep, great. Yeah, but the anaesthetist rooms will also probably contact you beforehand. Okay. They'll go through their fees with you as well. Okay, so I'll pop all of this information in the folder with you. The hospital documents are here. You will need to go through them and fill them out and get them back to the hospital as soon as possible. And then there's some information on the hospital as well as... Good. Do you remember me? Linda. From the office? Hi. Yeah. A lot of people don't recognise me when I'm in scrubs. <laughs> so, um, uh, you're here yeah. at the hospital today. Now, I'm just going to go through a few things with you this morning. Okay. Um, I've got your consent form. I'm just che double checking again exactly what we're doing today. Okay. So, you get the right side, yeah. Yeah. So, right total hip replacement. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Um, do you have any further questions you'd like to ask me about your surgery? No. I basically, I suppose, how long will it be? The actual surgery itself yeah. um, is not very lengthy. It's usually about an hour or so. Oh, right. However, the preparation time for um, uh. doing your anaesthetic and also waking up and that means that your total time that you'll be in theatre and in recovery could be uh, three hours maybe. Right, okay. Just depends, okay? Mm, um, that's fine. But um, once you wake up in recovery, They'll keep you there until you're comfortable and stable and then you'll go back up to the ward. Okay. Okay? Yeah, it sounds good. Excellent. Um, now, Dr. Almadiris will come and see you in a little while as well. Okay. Um, I'll just check a couple of other things. Do you have any allergies at all? Mm, no, I'm allergic to sulfur. Okay, and they have that on your band? <coughs> yes. Okay, because of that we're going to give you a red hat, groovy little red hat oh. to pop on. <laughs> yeah, I noticed okay. everyone else has blue. And the other thing I'm going to do is just check your armband as well. So you're Francis Johnson? Yes. And your date of birth, please? 3rd of the 4th, 51. Excellent. So that's all you, so that's all confirmed. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Okay. Well, I'm going to go and tell Dr. Armadiris that you're here and he'll come around and see you shortly. All right, then. Okay? Thanks, Belinda. That's okay. You're welcome. I'll see you up there. Yeah, <laughs> see you soon. <laughs>、Hi. Hi. 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 Now, I have to go through the consent again with you. We've been through that a、uh, couple of times, but、um, for、I、formality,、understand. I would like to make sure that we're, we're doing the right thing.、Mm -hmm. Now,、um, what are we doing today? The right, the right hip. We're doing right total hip replacement、That's、using、right. the anterior approach.、That's、is、right. that correct? That's correct. Okay. And、uh, your name is Francis Johnson? That's correct. Okay. And、uh, that's your signature over here? Mm-hmm. Yes,、yep. that's correct. Excellent. And I'll sign over here. And we dated today. Excellent. Now, do you mind if I just pull the curtain、mm -hmm. down? 
and which side is the right side? I know it's a stupid question, but it's very important. Mm -hmm. Okay, and um, I'll just um, mark the leg. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's the leg. That's you don't have to move. It's all right. Okay. Okay. You're gonna put here. Yeah. So we'll put an arrow indicating that it's the right hip. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's it. Great. All good. Okay. Excellent. And you're prepped and draped. Okay, I'll just check. Mm -hmm. Feet are alright. You do have some shortening on this side. Yes. Okay. Sir. So um, normally we will get you either equal or slightly longer on this side, but that's um, to give uh, stability of the hip, and yes. that's normal. You will not feel uh, any difference. You will feel that the new hip is is different, but it will take around two three weeks to adjust to the to the new hip. Yeah. Okay, and then. By six weeks, you will walk without noticing that there is any any limp or any any problems. Okay, majority of the patient by four to six weeks uh, they walk normally, basically. Okay, mm -hmm. in my hands anyway. Good. Okay, we'll Good look after idea. you. Thank Take you. Care. Thank you. We're doing the right hip today, so that's the left, that's the right, that's the right. Okay, it's a she's a female. Um, not very tall, so say 52, maybe 52, maybe 54. 54 looks more like it. It's between 52 and 54. So get a marking pen, let's mark the center of the femoral head. That's where it should sit. I prefer to lateralize the femur. Okay. I'll cut will be around here. Maybe down a little bit. Looks all right. Okay. So 54. 52 to 54 cup and the stem mm -hmm. see if it's a size 4 or 5 say size 4 4 is a bit small maybe a 5 5 looks more like it okay so, and she will be short, short neck, short head. Okay, so stem size four to five with short head.